you you really want to um, ask the patient specifically as much as you can about the mechanism of injury. Uh, that will tell you so much uh, for what's likely to have been disrupted. Uh, so you want to ask uh, the scenario around how it happened. So um, I'll give you some examples. The if the foot is fixed and 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 the patient says my foot got stuck in something and then I was twisted over the top. Um, typically, you're a little you're concerned about a higher grade injury and you definitely want to be checking the syndesmosis. So uh, mechanisms of injury really ask what what happened with other players involved. Uh, for example, again with syndesmosis, uh, th they rarely happen in training. They happen mostly in games uh, where there's unplanned incidents. Um, so uh, here in Australia, we have one uh, a decent one last summer, a grade a grade three syndesmosis injury in a surf lifesaver. Uh, so running in and out of the surf where the the beach is undulating, it's easy to get your foot stuck mm -hmm. in a, a little hole, um, and a, a wave can come and knock you over, or um, there's other forces at play. So those sorts of things, of course, in the common sports, um, uh, the the world game, soccer, uh, football, if if another player is involved and the foot gets fixed, um, uh, rugby. Uh, here in Australia, we have Australian rules football, and we we do do high ankle sprains there. Usually, when um, the the foot's got jammed and the player has been tackled over the top of their foot um, and twisted to the ground. Um, so those sorts of questions to ask the scenario, the mechanisms of injury. Was anyone else involved? Was your foot uh, free or or fixed? Um, and then some other more simple sprains. Did you land on a, another player's foot, for example, in basketball or netball? Um, or was it um, a movement error? I went to change direction and my ankle gave way. If that happens, then you're you're suspicious that um, they've got potentially some degree of underlying chronic ankle instability, uh, or potentially they're favoring some other body part. And so the, um, they're not moving well. So